The Commissioner of Agriculture Andy Gibson was in the Pine Belt today to lend his support to a business that's providing Mississippi farmers with a new way to get their products from the farm directly to the table. Charles Harrington has more from Hattiesburg. Commissioner of Agriculture Andy Gibson joined in on the festivities at the grand opening of Mississippi Farmers Meats at the old 11 Plaza. Glad to be here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. The store sells locally farmed and processed meats along with fresh local produce and dairy products. We're trying to sell it over here to the consumers directly, so it's, it's a farm to table. It is coming from a farmer. Thank you very much. This is the second Mississippi Farmers Meats location. The first is over in Summit at the site of a meat processing facility that Cassed has operated since 2000. The only way that Mississippi is going to grow and the surroundings is if we support every farmer. If we don't support the farmers, they will be going out of business. Cassad got some state support in helping his business, and it all came about because of the COVID pandemic. Back during the COVID-19 crisis, when the supply chain collapsed, we realized that we needed more local meat processing, and he took advantage of a program that we launched through Land, Water, and Timber to expand his operation, and that expansion has made it possible to have more local Mississippi beef pro processed there, and now today, actually, you can come here and buy retail. Cassed says he wants to open a total of 10 Mississippi farmers' meats in Mississippi and Louisiana. Charles Harrington, WDAM7, on your side. Kassed said his next location could be in downtown Hattiesburg and on the Gulf Coast in Ocean Springs.